My name is Nilos Martens. Um, I was born in Copenhagen, Denmark, uh, where I, as a young child, uh, grew up in the Royal Danish Ballet. Uh, was part of the Royal Danish Ballet School uh, as, as one of the kids there. And um, one of the things that was just wonderful about that upbringing was that as kids, um, in, uh, growing up in an opera house, a European opera house, we got a chance to perform in, in, um, with the company, both the ballet company and the opera company and, and, and also the drama. And so we got to perform uh, at a very early age. And uh, I did many of one of those ballets, uh, the children parts, probably most of them. Um, and um, so it was just a great, great uh, upbringing in terms of uh, what I do. And one, two, three, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, and down, 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 so stay. Bourneville was very influenced uh, by the French ballet. Bourneville himself was born in Denmark, but he went and studied in France uh, when his father um, got a grant to go back to Paris. The biggest elements in his style is his musicality, his uh, ability to make interesting steps and combinations, um, his storytelling, really. He was a great, great storyteller because he was a very well-traveled man and he brought all these stories back to Denmark. So that was great. Um, yeah, so I mean, that's really what um, that kind of um, wraps around what, what he really was about, his choreography. Da -da -dum, ba -da -dum, bum, bum. Exactly, travel. That's right. Dum, bum, ba -da -dum, bum. Now just go upstage, don't go so much side. Here? So we're at this side of center, right? Then we're not gonna end up so far. That's right. They are so hard, these steps. There is so much jumping involved in his choreography. Um, and to, to make it all at ease and, th and, and show the grace. And also another thing that's kind of interesting was that he was very much into having women jump almost as much as men. So it was a very equal kind of um, dance load, so to speak, for both parts. Uh, he himself was actually a wonderful, wonderful male dancer. And um, which was probably one of the reasons why he could even like think of so some of these things that he did. Here, that's right. Two, three, four, and so say. And down. Bourneville actually was known um, as an entertainer a storyteller, a great entertainer, and he, there was a quote uh, from him that said that I want my audience to um, love ballet, love dance, and also and leave the theater you know, with a happy feeling and even thinking that they pos possibly could dance. I mean, he wanted people to think that it, that it was possible to do and that they wanted to do it. So like to really be part of the whole thing, not so much as a spectator, but almost that they were part of the, of the experience. 